السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome to Mobile Electronic Diagnostic This is Muhammad Harun Idris and my friend Carlos If you need to fix a car and you are on flashing side, right? Yeah, flashing uh, side Shop is very beautiful, nice uh, you, Your car will be get fixed, body shop and working Today, this car here uh, We have a Vaftronic coat And also no communication with the original computer Um this is X5 E70, you see, E70 BMW X5 with uh, uh, four point something no. engine, right? Or five, uh, three point, three point oh engine. Now, if you put this computer, if you don't, if you are not able to communicate with the original computer, what you're gonna do is to put the original, the, the aftermarket computer or the, the computer from the junker and you go to AutoHex. I'm using AutoHex. Maybe you're using something else. Let me close this one. Um, AutoHex for programming uh, and swapping the computer and updating. So you're gonna go to ver uh, BMW. This is version, uh, this is the latest update. If it's not, an update will come here and try to update it. Charger must be in a car. Now you go to coding and programming. And from coding and programming, you're gonna wait a little bit. Ignition have to be on. There is a couple of steps you have to do. <clears throat> First, you need to read uh, the this secret code or SIN um, or ISN, ISN, right? Mm -hmm. You see ISN from the cast here, like here. You're gonna go to this place and it will open another page. In this page, there is two things you're gonna do. You see here, it say read DME ISN or read write cast ISN. That means you cannot, you can read the ISN from here and write it from the use one you have it from the junker. You're gonna read the ISN and write it into the cast. You cannot write ISM into this computer. That's that's one thing we have to do. So you're gonna come here and try to read the ISM from D from from D D E. You click on one. When you click on one it will open this page for you. And then you just go don't go here. This is to write down. Here don't go to writing and do anything. No. Just leave it as it is. So you're gonna go to this side here and you click on it. It takes from one minute to maybe five minutes, ten minutes. You will see the ISN or DME SK. And then after you get it, you are going to save it on the desktop and write down the information of it correctly. If you don't do that, you will you will lose or you will not know where exactly the file is. Take a picture where it is, or even take the picture of the numbers. Right now it's 45%, as you see it here. Please subscribe, share, and like. And if you have any question, feel free to ask. If you have any information, support our uh, page or our YouTube channel, please be sure. Uh, uh, we will be appreciated if you can do that. It will help us. Uh, question also ask if I am not able to answer the question the, all of us here we are to help each others so here is in a 70% be sure your battery is charging you have a good internet we are reading the information right now from the the donor computer from the junkyard and after that you can code it and program it sometimes this computer could be slightly different for another car you know like it could be for another car but if but it can take the same software be sure that you have the right part number like it, they have some part number here be sure that this is your dme and this is the right part number that you are going to put into your car you understand if you don't have the right part number, you may get trouble when you put it in. So here, we are almost there. This is 100%. If everything goes well, you're going to see a number here. 
Sometimes you read two times, but just wait a little bit. See what's gonna happen here. You see, this is this is the the SDME secret code that is inside. What you're gonna do is you're gonna save it. Save it here. Write it down. The whoever uh, the name that you're gonna remember. Okay, I already have. I have it here already. But just save it here, and then you go. You're gonna get out of this. Oh, oh something happened. Maybe I click something here. But if it's not, let me see if I can go back. Just try to be sure that you don't click on the mouse too much, and then go back. So as soon as we finish this one, the next step is to go. Hopefully, I didn't. I didn't. Let me close it because something maybe it's freeze. So now, just let's go back quick. Where we're we gonna go? So you already have the secret code in 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 your file. Now you're gonna go here, go back again because I close it. Go to coding. I'm gonna you're gonna wait for a little bit till I uh, log in completely. Anyhow, after this here, I just wanna show you that we're gonna come to the same page. In this page here, we're gonna we already have the the SKU from the DME. We're gonna go to read, write, cast, SN. That means the SKU that we get from the DM, the ISN, we get it from the DME. We're gonna click on the second page here. And from here, it will open another page for us. You see, we already get the DME. Now, what you need to do, you're gonna click on download and you go to the same file that I told you before, which is uh, this one here. You click. You open it it's gonna be the same file that was from the Indian computer that in the car be sure you have a charger battery but there is one thing I want to tell you and then you just click on write as soon as you write this one you're gonna write it back to the cast and you're good to go here is the problem also don't forget if you click on cast it will not allow you to do a key or to write down the SCN that you have it from the engine computer unless you have to downgrade downgrade the CAS so you're gonna go to CAS firmware which is here that's why we're getting code and now in this place here this function used to downgrade to downgrade the framework CAS to 3 so if you don't downgrade it you will not be able to do any functions as soon as you finish downgrading and you do your function, you write your key, you're going to go back and restore it. You see here, click here, restore back, because I already downgraded it. You're going to downgrade or restore it. Right now, I'm trying to restore the latest update to the software. It takes like 10 minutes. Remove the key from the ignition slot. Don't forget to do that. I take the key out. I'm going to put the key here. And then I will click next. Now we are downgrading. <clears throat> The cast frame. Um, we already write down the, the we wrote down the, the, the information uh, to the car. Mm, the, the the ISN is being written. The car is supposed to start right away now. There is no EWS code. We have EWS code before. We are not able to clear it because of different ISN. So now we are writing the flash data back. It take maybe about ten minutes to finish and you're good to go <clears throat> we don't have anything more than that so hopefully this information will help this car i already started it'll start good i just want to show you the process what you need to do please subscribe share and like and see you in another video if you have any any question feel free to ask or yes hold on yeah, this is the BMW here. Okay, let me stop this full video a little bit. Okay, uh, I was I was about to to close my video, but I say you know what? Let me finish upgrading the the module 
and then from there I will restart it you see here it's hundred percent but maybe there is another programming this is restarting my the module is your flash code complete now I'm gonna turn the ignition on where is my key this is the key I'm gonna put it here one if you have a computer like this with a cast module and you need to re rewrite the cast module, please send it to us. I will do it for you. Okay, let me see what I have here. Okay, now I'm gonna I'm gonna do here. I turn the ignition on. Let me start the car now because I already programmed it. My car is start. I already started before, but okay. Okay. I gotta start now. Use use computer. Yeah, it's shadow because maybe you have some uh, uh, intake manifold leak. You have anything there? <clears throat> Let me exit this. You can check it out later, right? Mm -hmm. Thank you again for watching Mobile Electronic. I know Carlos is going to be very, very ready for the winter. See you, everybody. And thank you for watching our video. And see you in another video. Please subscribe, share, and like. If you are in Facebook, please visit us on YouTube on the link below. And if you are in YouTube also, check us in Facebook. And see you in another video. Thank you again.